What's up guys, Agent Marco here, welcome back to ESPN 2K5, well NFL 2K5. We're gonna go to ESPN 20th anniversary and there's a lot of choices apparently. You get to play, play any of these games and decide the fate of how you would do it. So basically, out of 25 games, I'm gonna create history. So let's see. So you... With the new heat system underneath the turf failed, the negative 13 degree temperature froze playing feels solid. In the fourth quarter, the Cowboys is 17-14. Green Bay's quarterback drove the Packers 6-7 yards to the one-yard line. Face put the prospect at a kick in a field goal to send the game to overtime. The Packers opted instead of a QBC. Score a touchdown of crown of NFL champions. Do we play the Packers or Cowboys? Let's see. Oh, wait. Oh, I can't. Oh. So I had to choose the Packers. Okay, that makes sense. Tap for speed boost, hold for the charge, shoulder charge, spin, dive. Ooh, I really like how they display the controls. Say control is mine too. Okay, so it's uh, first and ten, four minutes, fifty seconds. I pro. Let's see. Uh, we're gonna do uh, receiver a four. Okay, so let's speed to get down the field. It's ice bowl. Okay, here we go. And knocked away. Second to Ted. So, okay. I This is hard for me. I'm a diehard Cowboy fan. And this hurts. I'm just going to say it hurts as heck. So, we're going to have to go get down the field. See, down the field. Ooh, okay. So, third and five. And we got a few yards. Uh, five yards off the, on that. Let's try to do. Let's see if I could try to spread. Let's see if we could do a uh, receiver beca again because we really need to get down the field and quick. Oh, uh, wide open! There he goes, and that's a huge hit. Oh, there he goes! Oh my word! That's gonna be all the way. Touchdown, Green Bay! The fullback makes the play, and that is a huge touchdown in the cold. And these will not be the 70s Packer fans, really, but that's a huge play right there. Huge play. Look at that replay. There was a short pass. The, the quarterback was about to get rushed, and he made a play. And look at this. He just ran down the field and just not uh, eluded not one but two tacklers. And he just kept going, going, going all the way. Touchdown. We are rewriting some history. So we got to do a field goal here. That was a 63-yard pass. And let's see. It's cold. But we could do this. Here we go. And boop. That's easy. 21-17. But we have to set up our defense now because we they still got time to get back in the game. Let's see. All right, ooh, we're just catching up. We're just catching up a little bit. That's why it's moving a bit. So let's try to take it the um, pay. So they all to get free for the kick. There's a high kick, and this ice bowl is going to be quite chilly. Well, here's the thing. I have a I and uh oh, down on the 25. So the Cowboys will be getting ready to receive, and they're applying the guy like, "Hey, you did it! Uh, yeah, thank, thanks. We're ahead, but we." But now we have to stop him here. Let's see. Number 12. I believe that would be Roger Staubach. But they didn't, they're not using the names of the players. They're using or just saying like, oh, quarterback, putting back and all that. And oh my goodness, that is wild. So that was a huge one. And here is the bear full zone. So, so it's second and 10. Roger Staubach's going to need to get down the field. And I'm going to pass. Oh, oh, that's intercepted by the, the number 63. A huge interception. Shows the world what they are made of. Woo! Oh, my word. Let's see that replay. He, the, the, Roger Staubach threw one in the middle, and the guy just jumped and got in the way. That is legal. Illegal interception. So now... We're going to try and run the ball down the field because we want them to know something. We're going to get down the field. We're going to score. Let's try to go down the field a little first. And huge 
That's a three-yard run on the play, but we're going to keep going because we do not want them to score. So there is a lot. There is more to this game than just cool highlights, but I, as I said before, this game is better than Madden. I did a video comparison. Please check that out. I worked very, very hard on that. And that's a one-yard loss, but that's okay. We'll, we'll show them. That's, that's a mistake they're going to live to make. So here, we, so here we go. Let's try to get down the field. Oh, short pass. Ah! Oh! Okay, there, we're on the, uh, what's that? What is that? The 32? Yep, we're going to go for a field goal. And, oh my word, it's 49 yards. But, how? what's it look like? Alright, so we're going to try it. We're kicking a little bit to the wind a little bit. But, we're going to do a full. We're going to try to do his full kick. Oh, no. We're, we better make this one. Please make it. Please make it. Boom. Oh! Uh, Oh, so close. So close. Oh, my gosh. So close. That interception was for nothing. We had a high kick, but let's look at, look how close it was. Just short by about a couple of yards. No sweat. Let's just get ready to step our defense up a little bit. Now, the Cowboys, they were pretty dominant back in the 70s. In fact, and there's another, uh oh, shoot, that is knocked away. Everyone's celebrating, it's snowy and cold, and there is a failure in the heating system, but they're still playing in the cold. Because, as I said, Wisconsin, and Green Bay, Wisconsin is way more used to cold than, than, of course, Irving, Texas, which is where the Dallas Cowboys originally were at. They're in Arlington now. And Roger Stiles is going to try and get away. He's getting away with a deep pass, and no, it dropped by the wide receiver. So now they are third and ten. We better, and here, and it's time to really make make it work because they're going to go deep here, knowing the Cowboys. They they want to go deep to get a first down. Third and ten. Roger Stallback, the quarterback, try to make a legendary hail mary. Will he do it? And he, and they're going to get ready for the play. Here is the play, and he's going. They fake a play action. And it's up the middle. He drops it away again. The Cowboys have failed to make any plays on three straight. And now there's a huge decision to make. Do they go for it or do they continue? And they will have to punt. The Dallas Cowboys will have to punt on four and ten with three minutes. Which I get they want to do that, but they don't want the Packers to get more points. And that's a way up there. That's deep. And, that's, and they're going to make a catch. And here they go. And that's a, some run, and that is on the 29 Green Bay. So if the Cowboys take advantage of this and make an interception, they could get a chance to take the lead back. But we're not going to make it that easy, right? No. This is painful. I'm a Cowboy fan, guys. So we're going to have to run the ball down the field first so that way we not only get some time in, but... Oh, ooh. In case you're wondering, that is horse collar is legal back then, so they... There's no flag for that. It's a three-yard gain on the play. So what we're gonna sell wide receiver, and uh, we're gonna try and do a halfback twenty-two. We'll go left this time. Cowboys will want to expect to pass here soon, and and that's a huge that's a huge gain. That's a five-yard gain on the play, and it is net. So now we need to get down the field once again. But I'm going to run again because I really want to get make sure that we get down there. There's a huge run, and that's a first down, Packers. Keep running the ball because that's what's going to take to win this game. So this is what you call making history. And the Packers show the Cowboys what they're made of. So now we're going to do a receiver route this time. Let's, and there's a two-minute warning now. Uh, the refs are wearing their modern uniforms in a um, 70s era. That makes as much sense as uh, saying that you should wear 2004 jerseys in a in 1970s. Okay, that's nice. That's I'm, that makes sense. Oh, it's a deep one, and that's a huge catch. And the Cowboys call a timeout. A huge play, but the Cowboys are going to try to stop the clock as much as they can, so they can have hope to make a comeback here. This is green, but the pack Green Bay wants to make them know. 
knows history. And that's knocked down by number 55 of the Cowboys. So there is some defense there trying to stop the Packers' fire. Let's try to we need to try to get down again. So let's see number 14 of the Packers. If you guys know who it is, let me know. Uh oh, they're after him quickly, and he throws it deep, and that is a touchdown again! Green Bay scores another touchdown, and that is a massive milestone. The Packer fans are excited. And despite this cold weather, this is completely unrealistic. There's no hat covering. And let's see, he, they were after him, and number 54 was after him, and they charged, and he threw a dime down the field. So now the Packers are going to do another extra point, and it will be a 28-17. to 17. The Cowboys have zero hope, like literal zero hope, because if they could, even if they made a touchdown, they won't be able to make a comeback, and that is in, and that is going to be a massive score, making it 28-17 Packers. So we're going to try... Let's see if I go go a little higher up. Let's see, high, 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 high. Yep, yep. We're gonna do a max kick on a high one, and that's gonna be up. Oh, whoa! That's way up there, and that is gonna be. That is a massive hit. And oh my goodness! Down to the 17. He would have been done taking a knee, and it would have gone to the 20. One minute, 42 seconds to go, and the guy's calling on the old phone, telling his mom or his wife that he made a big play, that they're going to go to the next round. So the Packers are on, are facing the Cowboys, who are on the 17, with a, with a long way to go to make to see if they can make a comeback. And there's a huge play and a knockdown! That's five straight plays that they dropped the ball for the Dallas Cowboys. Oh, man. So let's look at the, look at this. They have made eight attempted passing, but no completions. This is this could change though because it is cold, and they they stop the ball clock every time they drop a pass. And they're gonna try and oh the quarterback gets sacked, and they call a timeout. The Cowboys call their second timeout. So it's third and sixteen, with a long way to go, and the Cowboys are hoping to do a deep pass or a Hail Mary because that's the miracles they need. And the quarterback has a dirty pants from getting sacked that badly. And oh, that's a safety! That's a safety by number 74 for the Packers! What? That's why you never go back. Let's see that replay. He, he ran right at him, and then he tries to avoid it. Boom! If, if, my, if some of the guys from my from the place I teach saw that play, they probably want to try that in a real game because some of those guys play football. That's a deep one, and here we go. And now we're going to go for it, and that's a huge play. Now to the 47. So the Packers have made the two, three possessions so far. Two of them were touchdowns, but one was a missed field goal. That was bad. That was so close, too. We're going to run the ball, try to get the first down. Then we're going to do clock management and win this game. And now, here we go. And that is a massive five-yard gain. And there is another timeout for the Dallas Cowboys. That will be their last timeout before the game is over for them. So there's no more miracles left for the Cowboys. Unless they can do a couple pick sixes and onside kick. And, oh, that is a first down. And that's a huge one right there. So Davis made a huge play. So I'm going to look at, see if I can do clock management. They have that? Yep, there's clock management. And here we, here we go, guys. Packers fans are rejoicing. Because despite everything that the Cowboys tried, they lost the lead and they're going to lose the game. And they're taking the knee. So they're just trying to take it easy a bit because... They don't need to worry about go right down the field. Cowboys have no timeouts. The Packers have th all three of their timeouts. And here it now we're going to do another take knee. I have to admit, this game is awesome. Still better than Madden, in my humble opinion, because whether you like it or not, they have a lot more to bring. 
Especially when it, just in an expedition game, there is a lot more presentation. And we take a knee again. So that so that means that we ten seconds now on the clock. The Packers are going to, to what, let the clock run out. And it's four, three, two, one. And the Packers will advance to the playoffs. To the next round of the playoffs. And that's the end of the game. In this snowy day, the, the Packers win 30-17 over the Dallas Cowboys. And now the Cowboys will have to go home. They give their congratulations. And now, ladies and gentlemen, that's the end of the game. And let me know what you think. There's like four, 24 other games that are eighth man anniversary and uh, already their whole post game so show. They go back in time for that. Okay, so let's see. Let's so they do some good passing yards and rushing yards. Let's just say the Cowboys are look are making the Packers feel like champions. See that first play, the play that really ignited. The fullback ran down the field and he, despite the harsh snowy weather. He just kept going and ran right down the sideline for a touchdown to get the Packers the win. And then the Cowboys, Roger Stallback is the only name I know, tried to do it, but it got intercepted and it it destroyed the momentum. And then they try to go down the field again and they try to avoid their Cowboys defense. And the guy makes a great catch, making a touchdown to secure the lead. Then Roger Staubach tries to get, look for a guy, but number 74 in defense comes right there and boom! Knocks him down for a safety, and that was how we sent the message. So here comes the the Boomers player of the game, number 14, and they will talk to him right about now because they somehow go in time. You excelled under pressure today. And you helped carry your team to a nice win. What made the difference for you guys to come out triumphant today? This is how we do, as we always do it. We come together as a team. Probably use some sampled audio. Really helped me out. I couldn't ask for a better group of guys to play alongside. I'm just happy to get the W and ready to move on to next game. <laughs> of course, that's the interview, and that's the game. This is Lambeau Field celebrates. As the Packers showing all the footprints, all the snow they trampled, they win. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoyed, please like, share, and subscribe. And also tell me your favorite moment. And who knows? I'm definitely going to play more NFL 2K5. Anyway, you guys know what I'm going to say. God bless you, Rock. Don't forget it.